Which should until next time. Have a look. Make sure you're well prepared. Everything good? Thanks for your purchase. Come back soon. Very well. Let us be off. But it's not like we're gonna go in and fight him, right? So, what are we doing exactly? Uh, forgive me. I still haven't explained the details yet, have I? Since we need to stop the surveillance cameras and rescue the citizens, I believe infiltration is our best option. Usually that's not a problem for us, but what about the security? The Eisen Squad makes short work of anyone who looks suspicious. However, if you're less conspicuous, then you may have a chance. Um, what do you mean? Do we just walk right in through the front door? Yes, precisely. Needless to say, you can't go in looking the way that you do. So you'll slip past the security in disguises that won't arouse their suspicion. Oh, I get it. So that's where we're headed, huh? Yes, we're going to get you all fitted in some kimonos. Thankfully, I know of a silk shop that should be willing to help us. This is kind of exciting. You bet it is. When Lady On sees me decked out like a samurai. <laughs> Alright, then let's get going. Our destination is very close. Once we get to the end of the street... <gasps> Wait, stop! Please stop! I beg your forgiveness! Silence! Don't talk back to me! Those guys are members of the Eisen Squad, aren't they? Yes. No, it doesn't sound like they're looking for us. That's... It's the duty of every citizen to make an offering in return for Lord Yoshiki's love! You dare refuse to pay up? It's just... The financial strain is becoming... Since my husband's at the labor of love, I can barely make ends meet, sir. What a sorry excuse. I'll have to teach you what happens to those who disregard Lord Yoshiki's love. Authority figures threatening their citizens in broad daylight. How disgusting. I'm right there with you. Why the hell is everyone just standing around watching? Help her out! Unfortunately, I don't think that's going to happen. Poor thing. But I guess it can't be helped. That's right. As long as we have Lord Yoshiki's love, it's only natural. How is this natural? They're clearly crossing the line! We can't let this slide! I'm talking about on my behalf as well please help them we're not getting out of it this time however due to the cameras we need to make this quick <laughs> who do you think we are let's make short work of this guys better jot that down
show you! You have no money! It hurts! More enemies! Why now? My turn! I'm ready! Whip them into shit! Do my best. Vanquish every hand of doubt. Cause he'll lose the vibes are out of bounds. Now, call us on to Melius. Who don't kill us? Nobody wanted to impress. Working on the thorough part. Move our way or be not all. Now's the time. all right now. You're not hurt, are you? Uh, who are you? I will explain more along the way, but we need to leave now. You're Lady Yuki. Huh? You two know each other? It is certainly a strange coincidence, but this lady is in fact the owner of the silk shop we're headed to. You must have your reasons for coming here. Please, follow me. Everyone, just this way, please. Please forgive me for asking so much of you. As I said on our way here, we need you to prepare some clothes for us. My pleasure. In that case, I'll take everyone's measurements straight away. I'll start with the short gentleman over there. Come this way, please. Who are you calling short? It's not like you all are any taller. <sighs> Arena chan are you okay? Oh, I'm fine. It's just... This town's in really bad shape, isn't it? With the Rebel Corps, we rebelled against our ruler, Mario, because we'd had enough. So it made sense that there'd be some conflict. But it's different here. Despite falling...
following Yoshiki's orders, they're still being treated like... Dimension. If the people have been led to believe that this is right, it's even more tragic than if they were just being oppressed. Tragic, huh? Do you think the citizens really believe that they're being treated right? It's hard to say. Sometimes wanting to believe in something can cloud the mind's eye. But even a small spark of doubt should make it impossible to stay completely on the way. I was one step away. Fox, you too. Forgive me for interrupting, but may I take your measurements as well? Oh, uh, okay. Um, but could I ask you a question? Huh? Yes, of course. So, about what just happened, how people said it was only natural. Have you ever thought that it was even the slightest bit? My dear, all I do is run my humble silk shop. I have no complaints about my country. My only wish is to live peacefully under Lord Yoshiki's protection. I see. However, you never know where Lord Yoshiki's eyes may be. Please listen to me as I think aloud. A world without conflict is the best. Of that, I'm certain. I would also like to believe in Lord Yoshiki. I'd like to, but... Those who are taken away never return. And those left behind suffer more and more each day. I heard from Lady Yuki that you intend to fight the Aizen Squad. If it's all true, then please, you must save them. Help us to see the truth for ourselves. Yeah, we'll bring him back no matter what it takes. Thank you for being honest with me. The truth, huh? Hey, Oracle, do you have a minute? Hmm? What's up? About those cameras around town. I fear I've digressed too much. It'd be best to get back to work. Next up is the gentleman with the curly hair. Time for your measurements. warriors in the battlefield fighting for their ideals. <laughs> Not bad at all. He seriously likes these clothes. I mean, it's not even that different from what he usually wears. Huh? You're dressed like a samurai too? Apparently she was a little short on inventory. But I've always kind of admired this look, so I wanted to try it. Me or am I the odd one out here? Well, I think it's cute. You look like a rice ball. Oh, really? Well, I guess it's fine then. <laughs> we finished dressing everyone. This way, please. Wow. Look at that. I am a little uneasy about this. Ritual, Futaba? Yep. Now just say, please stop, my lord! And you've got it. Oh, I see. Please stop, my lord! So, did I nail it? We're all like flowers that brighten the festivities of any banquet. But it can still be improved. I can further draw out your inner beauty as I... <laughs> Yuki-san, isn't there something off about my disguise? No, no not at all. You look awesome, Mr. So Bowden. Yeah, you couldn't ask for a better petty thief. Quite the talent you've got there. What talent? I'm still going to end up behind bars looking like this. 
you don't like it? I'm sorry. I really do think it suits you quite nicely. Oh, no, it's not that. I was just hoping for something a bit more natural. Natural? Oh, then perhaps if you covered your body in leaves. Uh, that's not really what I meant. It seems like Toshiro just can't win against Yuki-san, can he? Ah, oh, what's it called? He's the type of guy who lets the woman wear the breeches. You mean pants? So, going back to our plan. While all of you were preparing, Yuki-san and I discussed how to proceed. I'm going to explain the entire operation, so listen carefully. Yeah, I can't really just charge in like this, so what are we gonna do? I've got it all planned. But first, hear me out. I call it Operation Double Pincer Attack Mach 2. This name's super lame too, but in a totally different way. Looks like this guy's got his own problems coming up with names. For this operation, we'll split up into two teams. The diversion team will pose as Eisen Squad members and use the front entrance. That'll be Sakamoto Kun's group as the Eisen Squad and Nijima Kun's group as the Geishas. It would be great if you could come up with an excuse to throw a banquet. If that goes according to plan, then you can ask around for info about the facility. There should probably be a control room somewhere in the building. And also a labor camp if the rumors turn out to be true. So, we'll infiltrate the Eisen squad and distract them while collecting intel, correct? Yes, and the team sneaking in through the back entrance will be... Morgana-kun, Sakura-kun, myself, and... Yuki-san. Yuki-san too? Yes, you're doing this for our sakes. I can't simply sit by and do nothing. I know all about this town, so I should be able to help, at least a little bit. I tried to stop her as well, but she wouldn't listen. In any case, our infiltration team will find an opening to sneak into their base. Our team's objective is to rescue the citizens and disable the cameras. Once we get into that control room, we've got this in the bag. Once we achieve our goal, we'll leave immediately. The diversion team will then also retreat. Well, that sums up the operation. Any questions? Excellent. In that case, let Operation Double Pincer Attack Mach 2 commence! My only objection is to that operation name. Oh, there is one important detail I forgot to mention. This plan hinges on the assumption it will all go well, but you may very well run into trouble. If you ever feel like you're in danger, make sure to retreat. Is that clear? Oh, well, why are you looking at me? Because clearly you need to hear this the most. Need I mention your prior record? If you act recklessly again, it could endanger the success of the operation. Well, do you get it now, huh? Yeah, yeah. What? What's with this attitude of yours? Ah, this is old man Kasukabe harassment. There's no such thing! That's it. Today, I'm going to speak my mind. You're... Those two seem to get along real well, don't they? <laughs> All right, everyone. We should return to my tea house for now. Yeah, it'd really help us out if we could use your place as our hideout. Infiltrating an enemy base will be very dangerous. So please use my shop to prepare yourselves as much as possible. Be sure to wear these disguises whenever you go into town as well. Choose. Until next time. Hey. 
Hey. Actually. enough. See. Of course. Really? <laughs> I 
<laughs> Impressive. Good idea. You've done well. <laughs> All right. Wipe them out. Okay, don't move. With this.
Until next time. <laughs> All right. I'll cut them down. Watch this. With this. Nice going, Bob. Prepare yourself. Now it's my turn. What to do here? Better get ready. All right. I'll cut them down. That All sounds right, good. Let's do this. Wipe them out. Mm. Better get ready. All right. I'm perfectly ready. All right. All right let's do this. Sounds good. <laughs> no. Now it's my turn. All right. Okay. Get ready! What 
to do here. I'm perfectly ready. But a stain upon my face. Wipe them out. Wipe them out. Now it's my turn. Now then. It's showtime. <laughs> Let's go back. What should we choose? I'll be counting on you. Hey. Mm. Ah. What should I do? However.
I should write that down. Let's go. You'll be safe there. Take this. 
the right. I should write that down. 